Hi guys, today, I filmed a guide by you to make the commonwealth into winter. If you use some typical mods, I have prepared mods that can make the commonwealth into a winter season enough. So please watch the video till the end, my friend, then I'll start. Winter Overhaul is a mod that adds snow terrain textures, snow weather, and elm trees to the commonwealth. Just think of it as changing all the visual elements of the commonwealth for winter. Even Winter Overhaul supports full LLD for all trees and not only will DLC not be sunny, it will also remove fog for sunny weather. However, Winter Overhaul also changes the weather system, so it won't be compatible with weather mods like True Storms and Vivid Weather. So if you're installing Winter Overhaul, it's best not to use any other weather mods. If you install winter overhaul and turn the commonwealth into winter, it might be pretty bleak. So it might be a good idea to add winter pine trees to give the commonwealth a more immersive winter look. There are probably many tree mods for the spring and summer seasons in Fallout 4, but not many tree mods for winter. Actually, thick leaves are not suitable for winter season, so I think a pine tree would be appropriate. Nuclear winter pits the sole survivor against the bitter cold of winter. With frosty aesthetics such as snow shaders, and visible breathing doomers. You'll have to fight to stay warm with thick clothing and seek heat sources or fall victim to debilitating ailments and arctic conditions. Core temperature is the internal temperature of the soul survivor. The core temperature of the player dictates the severity of ailments that occur over time and if low enough, leads to death. When this is a measure of how wet your character is. Standing in water, wetting, swimming or sweating increase this. Ambient temperature when speed negatively affects your core temperature and is more intense depending on the weather. Heat sources are any object that produces a significant amount of heat. This usually pertains to sources of fire. Fetting Signal's campsite mod also has a compatibility patch and some custom functionality so you can build heat sources on the go. Insulation is your armor's ability to maintain heat. Insulation is on a range from 0 to 45, 45 being totally insulated, 0 being totally unprotected. The insulation value of clothing and armor depends on the material, thickness and coverage of the item. To view your insulation, there is an aid item that is automatically added to your inventory upon mod initialization. Likewise, you may also assign a hockey in the MCM menu. There are several items that can give you temporary protection from the cold. Losing alcohol, hand warmers, blanket, water will help boost your core temperature or act as utility. Campsite is a simple, lightweight camping mud that is craftable, carable tents, sleeping bags, dogwoods, fires, lanterns, and cooking pot, each with their own unique with dynamics, sounds, interactivity. Simple enough for light play, detailed enough to make you feel involved. And in the cold winter of the Commonwealth, camping for survival will upgrade the fun of winter fallout for even more. Drop this at your campsite to put a map marker in your Pippi map so you can use it as a base, it can be used anywhere. And if you drop a fire kit, you can make a campfire on the floor. Placed fires will burn for four hours. You can activate the fire and relight it using another fire kit. If you have a cooking pot in your inventory, you will be shown the option to attach it to the fire to cook. Each camping gear can be used, picked up or moved. It's not detailed, but it can be left, right, front, back, up and down. Finally, each camping tool can be crafted in the camping gear category of camp station. This concludes the guide video to make the commonwealth into winter. Subscription like notification setting is very helpful for channel growth. Thank you for watching the video till the end. See you next time.